Hi guys, welcome to Tutors Funny channel. Today I am going to teach how to make the registration app uh, using Android Studio. Uh, let's show the demo first. If you click run. Now here the demo. Now here, if you fill the registration form, and click OK, you can see the toss message like this. Your name is, your address, phone number, email. All the stuff will be displayed on the toast. Okay, let me see how to do the simple app. Let's go to the file. New. New project. Here, next. Next. Empty activity. Next. Click finish. Now here, uh, now your new uh, page is created successfully. Now here, in this app folder consists of main two folders. One is a Java folder, Java. Uh, still, the grid is uh, still loading. here uh, app folder consists of two folders one is a java, a java folder inside the java folder there will be the file main activity after that this is the xml folder uh, rs here consists of the xml file layout file here the activity main.xml this is the file we are going to design the app so double click on this here Default it's come as hello world. Okay, if you run the app, you can check it the things. Now here our grid is running. Now here. Here the hello world is displayed, right? Now what I am going to do is here, here I am going to remove the stuff, go to the text, go to the text, here I am going to remove the default stuff, okay, main activity. Now here, instead of drag and drop the tool, I am going to design the registration form this registration form in code view okay it's very efficient uh, that professional way to do the test case we are writing the codes so let's go to the text here i'm going to first write as yes. here i'm going to first change the layout this linear layout linear layout here inside the linear layout i'm going to create another linear layout uh, uh, android layout width i am uh, create as match parent this one should be match parent width and height should be match parent here uh, after that I'm going to write the Android gravity this should be center select as center uh, Android orientation that should be must it is vertical right that's the tough you have to write that's the only thing you have to do now I have created two layouts, linear layouts, okay. Inside the linear layout, this la linear layout I have created. After that what I am going to do is here, I am going to create another linear layout. So here, uh, I no need to create again by again. Just copy this linear layout, Control C to copy and paste here. And we have a close, 
when you open the linear layout you must close it so you have to close the linear layout here so it's opening so just close tag right that close tag like this right now here right now here i am going to design the stuff so here i am what i am going to do is here here first i am going to create the uh, registration form heading right so what i am going to do is here here i am going to first write the text view so text view uh, text view wrap content this one should be wrap content height should be wrap content after that after that we have to write the another stuff android android uh, layout layout android layout mar uh, margin bottom this one layout margin uh, margin bottom 20 db we have to write as 20 db after that uh, android gravity center center uh, that's the only stuff we have to do the final we have to do is android text should be important android text here what i'm going to do is here text i'm going to this uh, i'm going to enter here there will be the folder values here the rs folder consists of four folders here goes to the values folder okay this values folder strings.xml here only string this one should be uh, the default displayed this is the app name my app application name will be displayed so here what i'm going to do is control c to copy select and control c to copy and paste it below here i'm going to put as title this one should be title so we have to write as this one should be registration sorry you have to remove the stuff you start you have to remove backspace to remove write as registration Right successfully. Now this title, control C to copy this name. We are to call here. So so what I call here is we no need to write Android colon text. Press enter key. It automatically displayed here. Okay? String title. You should be if you uh, click that and you can import like this. Okay. Now you can go and see the preview here. Okay. Simple preview. You can check see at the middle. Okay. The same thing go again here what i'm going to do is here i'm going to do another important stuff is here i'm going to uh, text size we have to change it as uh, 35 db so now you can see that see another now the nice look of that after the title i'm going to create the image so we have to write the image view right image view here we have to give the size uh, layout width as 100 sp the small size i'm going to select as sp means small right here small size i'm uh, selecting you can check the size as well go to the design here this one should be the size if you uh if there will be the design another one will be do blueprint blueprint also you can check here you can check the blueprint also you can check you can check both design as well as a blueprint here you can check right now i have keeping design right now let's go here i'm going to import the image so what i'm going to do is here the image uh, the rs folder consists of four folders image where you are going to store in global okay here so let's go to the folder where your image is uh, located in your computer here this is the image i am going to put so let's copy the image right click and copy and this is the folder i am going to paste it select the folder right click and here you have to there will be the option paste here this is the drawable there it asks the name which name you have to paste the same name i am going to paste now you can check whether the image is successfully pasted or not here click on this icon here this should be successfully pasted here okay if you double click on this one you can check the image here right now here what i'm going to do is here i'm going to import the image into my project so in android 
src the source so where the image is available here global slash reg this is the file there will be a folder uh, drawable inside the drawable folder there will be the file reg you have to select it particular one right that's the only thing you have to do you can see that the image is successfully here the successful image is uh, at the center now what i'm going to do is here go to the this one if you want to give the background color look like this so you can give here this one here so let's go to the text this is the linear layout you can give the background color so you can give here yes android background here there will be the color so if you go to the color you can check what are the colors available if you want to give the custom color go to the photoshop and get the color if you want okay here there will be the color you can this color code you can copy and paste it there so so i am going to get the color of this one primary color this one so that what i am going to do is here go here as this one what i'm going to do is here android background here color primary select the one as color primary here this one should be the color go to the design you can check here it's, it will be it's apply a full screen what's the problem is here the eye should be match pair there will be the problem so you have to give as wrap text so if you give the wrap text you can go to the design and check here it will be highlighted look like this okay this is how we can do the things let's change the color of this title registration so how, how we uh, change the color here this one the text view here we have to go here as android text color here we have to change it as i need white color so what i'm going to do is go to the photoshop here this one should be the white we have to this one white we have to white it is it one will be the color code for white just copy this one and here goes to the, the here so let's go to the color dot xml here what i'm going to do is here i just paste this one control c to copy this color paste here this one control x cut and paste here so here we have to change it as this one color white something if you give the name as color white right now here the color should be apply here white should be applied so the same thing you have to go here you have to go to the android dot text color here text white should be there here this is the color i will apply so here right now go to the design you can check okay the color should be successfully changed right now let me do the rest of the part now goes to after that is the layout layout file right okay this is the layout i completed uh, this is the layout here started we close the layout here okay after the layout I'm, after that i am going to create another linear layout so we no need to write again by again just copy this one control c to copy this one paste below here here after that we have to close the layout linear layout we have to close it have to close it remove the extra spaces so here the orientation view not is a uh, vertical this time i'm going to change it as horizontal horizontal uh, background color we no need the background color here we have to remove remove the background here so after that what i'm going to do is here here i'm going to uh, first time i need one text view so text view here text view i'm going to write two stuff is wrap text this is a wrap text this one should be wrap text right two things are wrap text here the android layout android layout uh, uh, margin uh, android layout left margin left 20 db that should be a must right that's the stuff you have to write after that android bit 
uh, here we have to write another stuff is uh, Android text so text we have to write as for the string copy this one paste here this one should be name this one should be name you have to write like this but what, what you are right here this this name should be goes to the app so this property have to code so go here we have to call the name so colon here text this one should be have to import the name right now let's go to the design and check here it's successfully here coming here okay here this one should be here so here what i'm going to do is here after that we have to write as what I'm going to write here, he, he, here is, uh, I'm going to write the Android, Android, uh, Android uh, text size, TV. the stuff here could give. So let's see the design here. Right, perfect. Now here, that's the only thing we have to do, only here. Uh, another stuff right it's completed after that i'm going to write the end of the stuff is uh, i'm going to write the edit text so i'll write edit text this one should be here as layout match parent height should be wrap text that should be right now here what i'm going to do is here i'm i'm going to write the two stuff one is a uh, android id ID we have to give ID so here what I'm going to do is here ID we have to give the ID so here I'm going to give the ID as uh, here we have to write ID comma here I'm going to write as this one should be name write as name right. you, you can write here the name okay that's how we have to write the ID you can check here it should be coming look like this after that here you can zoom out and check this is how you have to you have look like this now after that the same thing i am going to write the certain one for the uh, this one should be this one also address also the same stuff you have to write address and other stuff so you no need to write again by again the same thing you have to arrange them like this layout uh, linear layout start here and close it here this one should be the name stuff okay so you have to copy this one select and control c to copy enter control v to paste down here so here what are the changes we have to make is here string android text we have to make change and this one this text should be address we, we have to give any, any name here at plus id and address okay so here we have to change this one as string as uh, address so we have to make that this one should be address but it's uh, a short error no problem go to the string here we have to control c to copy this one control v to paste here this one should be address here we have to change it as this one as address now go to the go to your main action main active domain here they are go away your design look like this okay now here design should be fine now you have to do the remaining stuff as well same thing you have to copy again ctrl c to copy ctrl v to paste this time i have to change this one text as phone This one should be ID should be phone. Here goes to the text XML. Copy this one. Control C to copy. Control V to paste here. This one should be phone. Here this one should be phone. Right. What is the name you have to give here? The same name you have to give here as well. Here. Okay. The same name you have to give. Now the final stuff we have to copy the linear layout. Control C to copy. Control V to paste here. This one should be 
you have to change that to email. This one should be email, right? Now here, this one should be here as as email. Email. So you have to go to the string uh, XML. This one, Control C to copy, Control V to paste here. This one should be email. Here we have changed the name as email. That's the only thing we have to do. Right. Now let's go to the design and check how it look like. See, it look like nice. You can check here. Okay. Now you can get the nice preview like look like this. Now, uh, now if you want to, uh, now you are what I'm going to do is here you have to uh, right now let's. Let's execute the program and check. Proceed without run. Now it is ready. Wrap is ready. Good binding running here. Now here you can check here. Now your app is right. Now you can check here. Here, this one should be a design view okay now I need one button so let's go to here button so no need to put the button here so after that all the layout you have to uh, complete button we no need to create the layout we will simply uh, put the button here so you have to write as here button this one should be wrap content height should be wrap content here we have to type the text as well so here we have to type the text here android text here we have to type as here as string btn name btn so btn name uh, btn ok we have to type btn ok so the same thing here to go here we have to type as here ctrl c to copy ctrl v to paste here here this one give us b t n ok this button name i am going to i am going i am going to give ok so let's go to the design and check here the button should be successfully display over here okay now this is your design view uh, i hope you I hope you guys you understood so far. If you have any doubts, you can ask me anytime. Uh, in my next tutorial, I am going to teach the coding part, the main activity. I am going to teach in my next tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching. If you like my channel, please subscribe me, uh, like me. Thank you for watching.